performance of a garment to protect its user is based on a couple of basic principles. From a quality point of view, there are two main criteria. One is the quality of the fabric itself, where Tyvek is superior to SMS and microporous film fabric in almost all criteria, for example, mechanical and chemical properties. The other one is how the different pieces of which a garment is made come together. I don't mean the design of the finished garment, which is important by itself, but I mean how well the seams are done connecting the different pieces. Using a sewing machine to join pieces of fabric means introducing holes into the fabric, which are a potential weakness in its performance. Only a perfect seam, whether stitched, taped or welded, makes pieces of fabric become a garment with a superior level of protection. By the way, next to the seams, the quality of trims used like zippers, elastics, tapes and more are equally important. As in every industrial process, there is deviation over time and there are human errors. So quality control is key to achieving superior garments. For example, DuPont's quality process is based on clear definitions of defects at three different levels. For one, it is the supervision of the production plant themselves that we require to check the quality of the garments that they have produced. Then we have DuPont colleagues that are not linked to this production area check the same production in regular intervals. Lastly, and very importantly, we ask a third party from outside of DuPont to control our quality without prior notice of the production plant. At all three levels of quality control, we take statistical measures of our findings. Based on these, we continue to improve our products and with that, the level of protection for our end users. In conclusion, not all garments are the same and the quality of a garment depends on many variables, especially on the quality of the material and how the manufacturer controls the production quality over time. 